It's March 4, 2014 on Tuesday, 7.59 p.m. Pacific Time, and this is your Fukushima Radiation Report from e and &E News. This is the first report. Nuclear engineer says we've already seen genetic defects and radiation-induced illness after Fukushima. Baby of Navy sailor born with multiple genetic mutations. Mother pregnant aboard USS Reagan for Japan rescue mission. And this is a video. It was published March 4, 2014 at 12.44 p.m. Eastern Time by e, e News. Stuart H. Smith, ESQ, attorney with decades of experience in radiation cases, March 3, 2014. I noted last week that the news from the site of the Fukushima nuclear disaster in Japan keeps getting worse and worse. Every week brings new reports of leaks or potential meltdowns. There's growing evidence a large number of Americans already face serious health threats. The U.S. Navy crew that was dispatched to Japan for disaster relief, one billion lawsuit was filed by the sailors. Many of the sailors are already suffering devastating health impacts. Among the 81 plaintiffs in the federal class action are a sailor who was pregnant during the mission and her baby, A.G., born that October with multiple genetic mutations. That is sad. This situation is tragic and it's stunning that their lawsuits and the related information that has been revealed so far has not received more play in the American media. Interview with nuclear engineer Dave Lockbaum, Union of Concerned Scientists Nuclear Safety Project Director, True News, February 18, 2014 at 39 in. Question. When will we start seeing a spike in diseases and death rates attributed to Fukushima? The answer. Theoretically, we've seen that already. Some of the consequences of radiation-induced illnesses are low-weight births, genetic defects, things like that which would have already occurred. Some of the latent cancers, the latency period for cancers takes five to six years before you see a statistically discernible increase. But one thing is known is that it's going to get worse. Nobody is going to get healed by this. And you can see the full interview right here. And let's go to the next report. One moment. A Fukushima farmer says, Nuclear is the most terrible thing. People don't realize how horrible and scary it is. Sending this to future generations is unbelievable. I don't want to be their guinea pig. Mayor evacuated his own kids while trying to get families to stay. This is a significant crime. And this is an audio. Published March 4, 2014 at 4.45 p.m. Eastern Time by e, &E News. NHK March 3, 2014, with emphasis added. Japan's Education Ministry has revised its instructional booklets on radiation. The new booklets includes maps. They also explain the impact of harmful rumors about the disaster on the farming and tourism industries. Education Ministry officials say they hope the materials will provide accurate facts about Fukushima to help school children make the right decisions. Interview with Kenichi Hasegawa, farmer from Itate Village, Fukushima Prefecture, Greenpeace, Canada, March 3, 2014, at 4.15 in. They gathered residents in a very highly radioactive place. After these radiation-safe lectures, the mayor of Itate Village came and directly thanked the lecturers in front of the village people. This kind of thing repeated again and again. The mayor himself evacuated his own children to other areas. I think this is a significant crime. Children can't run away by themselves, and these lectures reassured the parents to stay here. And so the children stayed too. So I think what the mayor did is a crime. Mr. Yamashita, he was really terrible because he said what the government is saying is right. You have to believe them because you are the people. You are the nation. And also, he said, I'm a doctor, and I'm a scientist, and I have data backing me up. That's why you need to believe. The radiation, it likes negative people. I don't want to be the guinea pig. That's what I wrote and sent to Yamashita. What's incredible to me 
What's making me very angry, according to some news article in Asahi recently, those people are now saying that iodine pills should have been taken at that time, which is unforgivable. Nuclear is the most terrible thing. People just don't realize it, and now people are convinced. Or the government is trying to convince people that cheap electricity means nuclear power generated electricity. But in reality, from my point of view, people need to understand how horrible it is, how scary it is, and to send such a horrible and scary thing to the next generation just for cheap electricity. That's unbelievable. That shouldn't happen. Note, if actual costs spent fuel storage slash disposal, reactor decommissioning, accident risk, employee and community health effects, etc. are included, nuclear energy is the most expensive form of power generation, says former Prime Minister Junichiro Koizumi. And you can see the full interview with Hasegawa by clicking right there. And that's going to do it for your Fukushima radiation update. Please stay safe.